This is one of seven videos presenting the units of learning outcomes developed through the PIRATE project. Please also watch the introduction video about Earth Building and our European project. Equit Earth Building is a matrix of nine units of learning outcomes designed to create new teaching content and certifications. Unit E is the unit of the Equit Earth Building that covers the skills for developing a business in earth construction. There are two major challenges to this. Get clients, get paid for your work. Marketing how to make an interesting and positive choice in an old and new building. Earth builders have to be sales and marketing people to communicate the advantages and characteristics of earth construction to clients, architects, other contractors, conservation officers, local authorities, site manager, engineers, technicians, academics to name but a few. Small and big companies need to develop marketing strategies for economic, technical, social, aesthetic, ecological benefits of earth building techniques. As for any business, earth builders need to know the regional market and their specific target groups and work out a business strategy. Like all businesses, earth builders need the knowledge and skills to make bills of quantities and costings to draw up quotes. This involves measuring quantities and cost estimation based on plan reading and experience. It is helpful to have or join a network of earth construction actors when starting an earth building business. Use the resources that there are there. Producers and providers of materials and tools need to be found. Earth building is an expanding sector and it's exciting to see the innovation, products and developments happening in earth materials and construction. Codes and regulations for earth building also evolve, so builders and professionals need to contribute to the process, locally, regionally and nationally, with others in their network. As a contractor, the earth builder has to establish scope of responsibility and scope of works. Earth building companies often have to deal with professionals who don't know the properties of clay, the specifics of earth materials, and the principles and technology of earth building. As a specialist consultant, the earth builder may be involved in both design and review. She has to be able to identify good earth details that suit the design brief and, if necessary, advise and propose modifications. At site management level, the earth building specialist assesses the feasibility and project costs, mindful of the technical, economic and environmental data related to earth and use of local raw material. Training is an ongoing issue in the earth building sector. Earth builders need to coordinate their work with their own training, as well as for their team. Developing and maintaining a business, the marketing, running, training, costing and the rest within earth construction is a demanding yet empowering choice.